To leverage, manage, make the most of millennials, I think you need to do a few things. One is not have that mantra that I hear a lot, which is they have no social skills and uh, they don't know how to deal with people. The reality is they do, and although they're younger and they may need some additional coaching, any 16-year-old of any generation would need coaching on how to interact with a multi-generational customer base. So take that as an opportunity to contribute to their development. But more importantly, figure out what they know. Who do they like on Facebook? What are their, friend, what are their friends like? Uh, what are they involved in socially? How can you learn from their community, online and in person, and ask them to help you figure out ways to connect those dots? How do we get more people that are your friends or at your school to come to our business? Or if maybe that age group's not appropriate for your business or not your target, how do we connect with your parents or their community? and really leveraging them, kind of using the mindset of crowdsourcing, which is the belief that the answers really exist within our community. You just have to create a platform and a venue through which those ideas can be shared, collected, and aggregated. And if you get really good at crowdsourcing with millennials, with their employees, they'll not only want to work with you because they feel like they have purpose and value, but they'll advocate about your brand to their friends. And the millennial workforce unlike any other generation that at least I've read about, studied, or worked with, is making this huge, thick connection between the brand reputation and the company operating reputation. You know, you used to have Apple really big way up here, and then maybe their job reputation wasn't so great in some communities, just as an example. Mm -hmm. Employees now, and millennials, don't differentiate. If your brand does something wrong or is portrayed as doing something wrong, they will tell all their friends it's the most horrible place to work. And if your brand is known as doing something good, connecting to society, connecting to community, they will tell all their friends it is the best place to eat and work. So I guess the message is don't underestimate their power, don't overlook them, and create a forum where they can engage and give their ideas to make a difference. I think another way to really leverage millennials in the workplace and to learn best practices and how to manage them is to take a cue from reality TV. Whether it's American Idol, the fact that anyone can become a rock star singer by just using a flip camera and uploading the video to YouTube, tap into that core nature to be recognized and to be noticed in the virtual world, not just in person. Find ways to do uh, video competitions or photo competitions that can live online, where they not only can show their parents or their friends, but where they can be celebrated in where your brand lives virtually, whether it's your brand's Facebook page, Twitter page, um, your Flickr channel, your Ustream, whatever it is. Remember that these individuals have the ability and the expectation to become world famous in their own right, and you're really missing an opportunity if you don't tap into that.